stuff with this here? Uh, the only thing is you tap up to go up and like fall down to go down. If you want to reset it, it just tap up a bunch of times. Otherwise, resetting it the way you're supposed to. Do you want here. us using these dice? Yes, please, just because these are the same camera. Otherwise, the camera's already running. So you guys stop it.
Uh-huh. Swing for seven. Uh, no, no walk. Okie dokie. Feels like you're doing much more interesting things than me. <laughs> Is that Harold's the end? Yes. Tide rises, I'll get an insect. I do not have that token, so I'm just gonna put a little thing down. Yeah, that's good enough. It's a 1-1 one, one black and green insect creature token. Cool, cool. And, uh, sorry, I have a thing on this. Uh, and then I will craft this as I go while I search my library.
don't think you get a spawn though. Oh, you're cast. right, you're right, it's not cast. Yep. You're right. No worries. Not like it makes a big difference. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> that wasn't the part I was excited for. Yeah. Um, I will go to combat. Yeah. I had to splash blue just to make playable. I also had to splash blue just to make playable. Yeah. 
splash to make play? Well, it's six. It's a six-person pot. It's really hard to have good pipe card quality. Yeah, I'm playing two of these, which is like not the end of the world because there's Pretty stuff good. for it. But yeah. my red splash is more of a like almost a third color into my deck because I have like four red cards. I just had to play because my other cards were not that good. <laughs> Yeah, if I want to board things in, it's just taxing my splash even more, which, like, because I'm playing a number of cards at colorless cost, I'm really kind of playing a four-color deck, so it's already tough. So, and no, I, I have, like, I could switch blue cards out, basically, I think, so, but the one... I'm considering Serum Visionary or the uh, the draw three as I love a side card. Both of those cards. <laughs> oh yeah, but no, they're they're great. But I just don't think it's what my deck really wants, wants for the most part. Because I'm already kind of like slow and inevitable uh, with this deck. Uh, it's just so it's like try to get faster. So it's like I could switch him for one of those or something, but he's quite good. Yeah, and he... And this, like, you can't really switch out. It's too good for my deck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This card is super... That's why I was like, I'm gonna kill that. And then you made it bigger, and I was like, okay, I'm gonna kill the other thing first, then I'm gonna kill you that. You had the removal, though, <laughs> so much, so that works good. Yeah, I did get lucky to get two of those consumings. I got two Wither and Blooms, and... Wither and Blooms are awesome. Yeah, and a copy of whatever the... The red one, this guy, the Fang Flames. Yeah, I have a couple Fang Flames, and uh, that's I have a signature slam. That's pretty much all my removal, though. Oh, and the the bridge works battle. That card's sick. Oh, and the Ghost Fire. I actually have some removal. Yes. Yeah, so, oh, Ghost Fire is great. Yeah, yeah. Although I picked it over a three mana three three that makes a spawn when it dies and, and when you cast it. And I think that was maybe wrong as the way my deck ended up. Because I, I think I needed that more than the ghost fire, but it's it's tough. It's, it's kind of close. It's tough. Well, and I, I ended up with plenty of removal, and like colorless could be a stretch for me. So, yeah. like I don't have a lot of things that make colorless other than this guy, basically. 